Welcome to this exercise on changing motor oil. This is your workshop. We have just received a motorcycle for a maintenance oil change. Before we begin the engine oil service, let us wear the safety gear. For this exercise, we will need a goggle, helmet and a pair of working gloves. Identify the safety gear workspace first. Well done. Click each safety gear to pick up and wear it. First of all let's put the motorcycle on the race platform. We need a hard even surface to measure the oil level well. Click the motorcycle to park it on the platform. Park the motorcycle using the center stand. This is important in order to get a proper reading of the oil level. Click the highlighted center stand. Great, you have parked the bike. Why should you park the two wheeler on the center stand before changing oil? Correct answer. Elevate the workbench to a suitable height for ease while working. The next thing to do is to collect all the tools needed for this exercise. Please move closer to the shelf by selecting it. Select the tool trays. Next select the oil tray. Which oil needs to be selected? Wrong answer. Correct answer. Select the oil. Let's now select the funnel. Select the spanner. Select the screwdriver. Finally select the cleaning cloth. Well done. You have collected all the items needed for changing motor oil. Please move closer to the platform by selecting it. You can have a closer look at the oil plug. Click the round circle to have a closer look. Well done. Now locate the drain plug on the lowest part of the engine. Clean the area around the drain plug. Use a screwdriver to scrape off the dirt or mud around it. Click the screwdriver. Grab the spanner and open the drain plug. Click the spanner. Now wait till all of the oil has been properly drained. Warm oil drains faster due to higher viscosity. Be careful not to burn your hands when hot oil drains out. Why should you not touch the used oil that is being drained out in correct answer? Now that the oil has completely drained out, we can screw the plug back into the drain hole. Finish off by tightening the plug. Click the drain plug. Good job. You have tightened the oil plug properly. We will now replenish the engine oil. For this unscrew the fill cap by hand or with pliers. Click the fill cap. Insert the funnel into the fill hole. Remove the cap of the oil bottle and click the bottle. Pour the manufacturer specified oil. If the specified amount is not known, start with 0.8 liter. Click the bottle to stop pouring. And remove the funnel. After you have poured the oil, check the oil level with the dipstick on the fill cap. Click the fill cap. Do not screw in the fill cap when you check the oil level. Check the oil level on the fill cap. If oil has not registered on the dipstick, add 50 milliliters. Insert the funnel into the fill hole. Click the fill cap. Check if oil level is between the low and high marks. Click the fill cap to insert it. Oil is between the low and high marks. Well done. You have poured the right quantity of oil. Why is it necessary to start the engine for 5 minutes and then wait for a minute to check the oil? Correct answer. Now to start the motorcycle, turn on the engine. Click the highlighted part. Let the engine run for 5 minutes. Turn off the engine. Wait for another 1 minute. Now check the oil level. Take out the oil fill cap to check the oil level. Click the oil fill cap. Click the oil fill cap to replace it back. Click the platform to put the objects back to their proper place.
Lower the motorcycle. Now the motorcycle is ready to be delivered to the customer. Congratulations. You have successfully changed the oil of the motorcycle.